This is Noko. You are witnessing the semi-finals of the men's super lightweight tournament. In the blue corner, Hiroaki Suzuki and his opponent in the red corner, Hukashi. The highest level around this Ladies and gentlemen, could go either way. Both of these fighters in peak condition. Both of these fighters as violent as they come. First contact there from Fukashi to the body of Suzuki. Suzuki with his trademark teeps and front kicks to the midsection of Fukashi. Switches to the inside low kick and Fukashi replies with a high kick of his own. Goes to the body now, Fukashi. Staying busy in the center of the ring is the Thai born Fukashi. Hiroaki Suzuki also in his trademark long, shiny spats. Keeping his chin tucked in nice and low. In southpaw, Suzuki in orthodox stance, Fukashi. Fukashi going to the body again with the right cross. And in low with the low kick. Still trying to find his distance. There's the jab popped out in there. Suzuki saw it. Follows up with a right high kick. Again, Suzuki clocked it and swayed back. Staying very busy with the low kicks is Suzuki. A little bit of a slip there from Fukashi. He gets back up. Straight back to the action. Closing the gap a little bit more. The distance starting to narrow between these two super lightweight tournament semi-finalists. Gashi staying busy with those low kicks. Looking for that right cross. Trying to get the long jab in there. Suzuki constantly popping in inside and outside low kicks. Plus his teep to the body. That's one thing about Suzuki, he replies every time he receives a strike, he replies with something. Usually a very sharp kick. Looking for the 3-2 there, Fukashi. Suzuki resets his distance. Double jab there from Fukashi. Suzuki covering up, keeping his guard nice and tight. 30 seconds left in the round. Fukashi getting a little bit busier with that lead left hand of his now. Looking for an up elbow. Suzuki clocks in, steps back. Keeping his eyes high, kicking low, punching low too, Fukashi. Nice lead hook there from Suzuki. Just clipped Fukashi on the left hand side of his jaw. And we finish the round with both fighters looking really sharp. Both very relaxed, very calm at this moment, but make no mistake about it. When these fighters smell blood, no! they pounce oh! and they turn into something else. Round four in the semi-finals of the men's super lightweight tournament. We have a war on our hands here. Fukashi staying busy with the body. Now going high, putting a little bit of pressure onto Suzuki with his back up against the ropes. The body kick going straight in there. The in low is going in. Suzuki making no attempt to get out of there. Quite happy to cover up and fire back. There's that. Right cross to the body, an uppercut there from Fukashi. Goes back to the body, he's punishing Suzuki here. Suzuki trying to keep him away with that teep and a long left cross. But it's gonna take more than that to keep somebody like Fukashi off you. He is vicious. Left thigh kick there across Suzuki's leg. Going high on the right hand side now, Fukashi. Fukashi mixing it up just beautifully here. Just 
making it so difficult for Suzuki to guess what's coming next. Suzuki trying to keep his distance, but Kashi able to close that gap every time. Oh, high kick there from Suzuki, just swayed out of the way there for Kashi. Kashi with a big swing right hook there and the left. Neither of them hitting the mark, but he's keeping the pressure on Suzuki here. Going to the body. Suzuki still staying calm and collected. Buff Kashi putting on a lot of pressure here. Keeping Suzuki guessing. Excellent condition is Bukashi. Powerhouse just keeps going. Has no let up on him. Does not back off. Keeps on forward. In your face all the time. Suzuki staying low there, but no damage caused. He's going to have to close that gap a little bit more if he's to make any mark on Fukashi here in this fourth round. Long jab there from Fukashi, goes to the body. Blocked both times from Suzuki. Suzuki looking for a high kick of his own. One, two from Suzuki there. Not finding his mark. There's that body, look at the red welts on the rib cage of Hiroaki Suzuki. Fukashi just punishing him every opportunity he gets if he doesn't cover that body up. This could be an opportunity for Fukashi, for Fukashi to put in a high kick here if the left hand side of Suzuki's guard drops. Heavy right cross there, trying to fire back with his own left cross is Suzuki. Catches the kick, fires back. And that's the end of the round. Fukashi looking very impressive here. Laying on the damage to Hinoaki Suzuki. Suzuki, usually the aggressor, used to getting his own way. But here, Fukashi absolutely powering through everything Suzuki has. There's those body kicks. Look at the red welts on the body of Hiroaki Suzuki. He's struggling. He doesn't want to drop his guard too much on the left, but he's having trouble there. It's going to be interesting to see how he comes out in this next round. His corner giving him some good advice there on how to deal with somebody like Fukashi. As we come into the fifth and final round, of the men's super lightweight tournament here. This is knockout, ladies and gentlemen. Fukashi with the gold and white trunks and Hiroaki Suzuki in the long dark silver spats. Both fighters getting busy off the bat here. It's all on the line. Fukashi going high, going low, staying busy on that body of Suzuki. Suzuki trying to mix it up. He's lost a little bit of sharpness. Clipped him there. Suzuki clipped Fukashi there, had him on the back foot. They tie up looking for an elbow. He's in. Very close now in the clinch. Suzuki trying to get control and lay some more elbows on the face of Fukashi, but Fukashi doing well to defend that and getting out of there. Back in the center of the ring. Mixing it up now, Fukashi. You better watch out for those elbows. Suzuki wants to lay those elbows on his face. Getting very aggressive now is Hiroaki Suzuki. Fukashi doing well when he fights at his own distance and popping those body shots in. When he gets further in the pocket there though, that's when Suzuki has the chance to drop the elbows, looking for a lead left elbow of his own there, Fukashi. Going back to the body too. It is a wonder that Hiroaki Suzuki is still firing back here. Most men would have crumbled before now. Fukashi looking for the knees, staying in close, staying busy. Pushing forward now, Hiroaki Suzuki. Going low, back to the body there from Fukashi. That cannot be nice every time that lands. The right kick 
to the midsection of Suzuki, following it up with a right cross to the body. Sucks the energy out of you, takes your life force away, and we can see Suzuki is struggling here. He has his poker face on, but clearly Fukashi is turning up the temperature a little bit in this fifth and final round. The winner going through to the finals. 30 seconds left in round five. They clinch up. Looking for elbows, looking for knees. Suzuki pops in left near his own. Looks for a lead left elbow there. Getting busy with those elbows. Got to go back to the body. He knows Suzuki is struggling with those kicks and he sits him down. Looking strong, Fukashi. Suzuki back on his feet, but he's struggling here. How is he going to deal with the onslaught in the closing seconds of this round? And that is the end of the round. Hiroaki Suzuki drops to the mat. He knows he did not do enough to take that there. Fukashi ultimately taking out Suzuki with powerful shots to the body. How is anyone going to deal with that? Who is going to deal with that? Fukashi is a man to be reckoned with. Not many people can say they've done that to Hiroaki Suzuki. Today, we have seen Fukashi deal with business. Yes, indeed. Ultimate confidence in this young super lightweight tournament finalist. And now for the judge's decision. We all know how this is going. We just need to hear it. All three judges scoring it in favor of Kashi taking the win today. The Taiwan powerhouse of a fighter smashed the body of his opponent Hiroaki Suzuki today. Strong win there for Fukashi. Big congratulations.